just want to talk. Hey, can you hear me? job for you come on man I need your help! You broke into my home! You killed Leto! What else do you want?
Listen to me, you nutcase! Why must you bother me? Leave me alone, you hear? <sighs> messages and need you at the guild to take care of some overflow.
Tell me, Pilgrim, do these ancient walls not whisper their sacred history into your very ears? St. Paul's Cathedral is, along with Orla Castle, the oldest building in the city. It originated in 1010 as a Christian church that was built on the site of a former pagan temple. Subsequent work continued to expand the church, which became a cathedral in 1207. Its catacombs host many holy relics, including a toe from the left foot of St. Paul. This made the cathedral a popular Christian pilgrimage destination. In 1444, another relic, a finger from the Apostle to the Gentiles, was stolen. Eventually, the cathedral's popularity began to wane until it acquired a molar of St. Paul's. The cathedral briefly regained its status, only to see its pilgrimages decline steadily once more. Finally, after a hundred-year period, the finger of St. Paul was recovered, and the cathedral was again able to attract thousands of faithful. Surprise! Kill me. Just tell my son I died like a warrior. What are you talking about? Kill me. She sent you to do it, so do it. I have no idea what that's supposed to mean. I, I have a job for you. What? So you're not an assassin? No, I just came to talk. You're an engineer, right? I have a name. Kurt. What do you want? Who are you really? I'm a pearl cast before swine. I'm a king without a kingdom. I am tragedy made flesh. Right. You mentioned you had a son? Like everything else, taken away from me. I know how that feels. Spit in any street in this city and you'll hit somebody who lost a loved one. So, um... Who's this woman who wants to kill you? Vagina dentata. A vagina with fangs. Wait, what? A major bitch who wants my balls on a platter. 
That good enough for you? I see. Maybe I can help. You don't know what you'd be up against. I handled that monster down there. Leto? She was just a poodle with a speaker by comparison. Okay. What was it that you wanted again? I need to plant this bug on a radio transmitter, but it needs to be fixed. I'll make it worth your while. <sighs> Impossible without a few parts. What parts? Uh, the wiring is corroded. You can find replacements in the North Tower. The army left their gear there. How will I find it? It would be protected from the elements. So look for a box below the antenna. All right, fine. And, uh, what's your price? Let's leave that for later. As a surprise. I really don't like surprises. <laughs> Good luck. What is this place, anyway? church in the country. It was believed that a god lived inside. But I've been sitting here for almost ten years and haven't met one yet. This place is huge. Well, those who built it believed that this way they would get closer to God. But when the epidemic came, it didn't help anyone. Why did you murder those peacekeepers? I didn't murder anyone. I defended myself against people who wanted to rob me. Wouldn't you do the same if strangers broke into your home? I don't know. I never had a home. This is a hell of a hard climb. A marvel, isn't it? A miracle of architecture. The pinnacle of human achievement. Our ancestors crowning glory. And today, we just climb it like monkeys. Got it. Well done. I can see it's hard to discourage you. Yeah, I'm stubborn. Well, perhaps you will be of use to me. Return to me.
You have it? Good. <sighs> Wait a moment. You did it. Wasn't exactly hard. Okay, so... What's the surprise? What do you want in exchange? You have little to offer that'd be any use to me. Wait, what? I'm a programmer. In a world of people who only eat shit and sleep. What could you pay me? A pigskin? Five bottles of booze? The surprise is... I did it for your friendship. Oh, well, that is a surprise. I'm honored, I guess. You overcame my traps, defeated my defenses. Let's trust one another, Aiden. That will be my reward. Okay, Kurt. And, uh, thank you. Success. Kurt fixed the bug. I knew you could handle it. But you totally undersold how unreal this guy is. I told you he was just this side of batshit. That's why I don't like being alone. Don't want that to happen to me. What now? Not over the radio. Come to my quarters on the ship.
nearby.
since the last one. through the door with more books. Let me see. Let me see. Hardly. Franz Kafka might have thrived in our city. He wrote tales that blended realism and fantasy, creating surreal environments and scenarios. Doesn't that sound familiar? <laughs> the Metamorphosis was all about a hideous transformation. Yes, <laughs> he might have provided some brilliant insight into our current situation. Yes, you have preserved poetry. That's just what the city needs. Particularly the work of Pindar and his victory odes. They celebrate the triumphs of ancient athletes. And what is life today but a contest simply to survive? He was a firm believer in what man can achieve by the grace of the gods. Gods or no, I share his faith. I spoke about faith when we first met. Not only was that faith justified, you've now given me hope. Aiden. I've barely been able to focus, waiting for you to return. I see you brought Kafka's Metamorphosis. Albert's been after that particular book for a while. I'm sure Albert wax poetic about the theme of transformation and its parallels to the state of our world. A lot of wax, actually. <laughs> Two earfuls, at least. <laughs> That's Albert. But 
I'm curious what you think. Is the protagonist's transformation into a giant cockroach an apt parallel for what's going on in our world? Hey, don't tell Albert, but it doesn't really work for me. Oh? How so? I turn me into a roach any day over becoming an infected. I agree. I'm more apt to compare our world to Kafka's The Trial. We're all stuck in a maze of increasing danger and absurdity. There are authorities, but no accountability. No way to truly solve any problems. <laughs> Can't argue with that. Do you know? This might be a little out of turn, Aiden, but... I don't think I've ever been so aroused by a discussion of nihilism. I have to confess, Aiden. I was attracted to you the moment I laid eyes on you. So, if I come off a little thirsty, well... I am. But it's your mind, Aiden. You constantly surprise and delight me. You have a devastating combination of mind and body. I've said too much. I hope I didn't just drive you away. Please, Aiden, come back soon. Want to be sent back to the Outlands? Keep that biomarker in plain view. You're back. There. All fixed. Shh. Keep it down. Sometimes the walls have ears. Do you know what this is, Aiden? Looks like, uh, uh pellets, buckshot. <sighs> Dios, que triste. These are eggs, Aiden. You have some really small chickens. Fish eggs. Beluga, to be exact. Straight from the Caspian Sea. Considered to be the only true caviar in the world. Dissolves on your tongue. Letting you taste the waves of a black, deep sea in a faraway land. The world is full of beautiful things. Beautiful sensations. Pretty boys and pretty girls. But... Humorless grunts don't notice that. They kill for the future and they forget the present. They? The major mats of the world. Please, join me. I've taken care of the UV lamps. Has Matt confided to you why he needs lamps in a place with no electricity yet? And how he's going to carry out this suicide mission? That's what I thought. Contact him. Tell him the lamps will be delivered to the TV station. And Matt, the lamps are ready and waiting for you. Got it, Aiden. Good work. I hope Juan didn't give you any trouble. Juan said that the TV station has no power. What good are these lamps to us if we can't turn them on? Juan's just fucking around. Don't worry about that. One? Nah, he barks a little, but I can handle him. Good approach. Rabbit dogs must be kept at bay. And when they try to bite, put them out of their misery. Aiden, it's time we meet and talk about how to take that damn antenna. Wait for my signal. Roger. That. As you can see, Jack likes to give orders. Stay close to your radio. You'll be informed of the meeting shortly. Have some fun. Better conditions than we do. 